Testing one, two, three. Hello, everyone. Preacher Man Sports back again with another video. And um, you know what it is. This is the, it's the divisional round of the NFL playoffs, guys. And yeah, <laughs> it's getting there to the road of the Super Bowl. But you know, um, how many games were there last week? There were six games last week, and I um, I missed only one, and it was the um Cowboys led me down against the Niners. Fuck the Niners. I, um, sorry about the Cowboys fans. Hope you guys do well. You guys have a talent team, but they just need a better coaching staff. But see what happens. But as you know, moving on to the divisional round, we got a lot of good matchups. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. So the first matchup right away, we got the Bill Buffalo Bills versus the Kansas City Chiefs. The game's in Arrowhead because, you know, the Chiefs are the second seed. They had the advantage against everyone except the Titans if they face off. And you know what? Um, but judging by what the Bills did last game, both teams blew out their opponents. Give me the Bills. No, I'm not biased. Yeah, I hate the Chiefs, but the Bills, they, they proven a lot more, especially after what they did against the Patriots, who's a better team than the Steelers. That's who the Chiefs face. And to be honest, the Chiefs, man, like they don't, I don't feel that confident into them winning this game. I think the Bills, this is a rematch of the AFC championship. Remember these two teams faced off in week five. And the Bills blew them out. And it was in Arrowhead. So keep that in mind. And, yeah, you got to keep that in mind, man. So give me the Bills by a score of 31 to 24 or 31-28. That will be a nice game. But we'll see what happens. Um. On the next game, we got the Titans versus the Bengals. Bengals coming off a huge win against the Raiders. Thank you so much, um, Bengals. Fuck the Raiders and their fans. That piece of crap team, Mickey Mouse team, really thought they were going to do something. Oh, you, you're going to get your win, but not against this team. That was Raider fans, and look what happened. Ha, ha, ha. But, um... Uh, if you hear something, um, if you hear something, that's just from outside. There's like you know cars passing by, but um, Cincinnati versus the Titans. I don't, I know that the Bengals are a dark horse candidate. I would like to pick them, but I'm not gonna pick the Bengals. So just give me the Titans. The Titans, they're getting Derrick Henry back, and it's just as simple as that. Derrick Henry's coming back. They're getting. Julio Jones more involved, and this is going to be a wild ride. I can't wait to see this game, to be honest. So give me the Titans. It's at home, <coughs> but I just see the Titans. The Bengals win. That, that wouldn't surprise me. It wouldn't surprise me. Burrow did great last game, but the Bengals aren't that good at stopping the run, so Derrick Henry's probably going to eat them up. But give me the Titans, man. Next game, we got the um, Los Angeles Rams versus the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. So it's a rematch. Remember, these two teams faced in L.A. in which the Rams won, surprisingly. But this time it's in Tampa. And to be honest, give me the Rams in this case. Yes, I know Stafford's not that much. <coughs> that was his first playoff win. <coughs> but still... Um, give me the Rams and the Buccaneers. This should be a good game. It's kind of tough to get this game. I mean, don't bet against playoff Brady, but keep this in mind. Brady's never won back back Super Bowls in his career. He usually wins one, and then he usually either misses the next year or he loses in the Super Bowl the next year. But give me the Rams in this case. Next game, uh, interesting game. We got the San Francisco 40 Winers. I mean, 49ers. <laughs> San Francisco 49ers versus the Green Bay Packers. It's in Lambeau. It's supposed to be freezing down there. And Niners aren't used to cold weather at all. It's supposed to be freezing. And to be honest, this might be Aaron Rodgers last year, and he wants to give it his all. So give me Green Bay in this case. 
I know San Fran legit owns Green Bay in the playoffs because Aaron Rodgers is 0-3 against San Fran in his career. And he doesn't play that well. But in this case, give me Green Bay. I don't think San Fran, San Fran, I don't think they're kind of a they're not a when you look at it, they just have Debo Samuel. Like Jimmy Garoppolo's trash. Brandon Ayuk is okay. They don't use George Kittle in the passing game. He's a blocking tight end. I'll definitely give him that. That offensive line, not that good. Except Trent Williams. He's a beast. On a defense, obviously they're missing pieces like Nick Bosa, but he should be playing. And Fred Warner's questionable. And their secondary, terrible. And they have a good defensive line. If you can hold down the defensive line, you can take away – you can – Pretty much have your way. And these two teams faced off in the regular season. And the Green Bay won with 37 seconds left, I think. And thank God for Green Bay. I hope Green Bay wins because I hate San France. But give me Green Bay. It's more realistic. It's in Lambeau. Packers are the only team who went undefeated in Green Bay. I mean, in their, like, home territory. They haven't lost not one game at home. Don't, their three loss, their four losses came from Detroit in Detroit, KC in Arrowhead, the Saints, which was a game that was in Jacksonville, so it was neither for them, and um, the Vikings in Minnesota. But give me Green Bay. So those are all my picks, guys. You know, um, just wanted to see what you guys think of them. So there's a couple like scenarios that could happen. Like I can definitely see, I can definitely see this happening. Tampa winning because they're obviously the favorite. I can see, the, I can see the Bengals winning, but I don't think it's gonna happen. And the Chiefs, obviously, that's gonna be a be- that's gonna be better. That can go either way. I don't care. But those are all my picks. I'll see you guys later. Peace out and good luck to all these teams. See what happens this upcoming weekend and. I'll see you guys next week when we make our uh, NFL Conference Championship picks. Peace out.